The Zhiji Zhouhou Baru chapter has been carried for Lim Ah San, who was paralyzed due to a stroke for 10 years. He used to be the breadwinner of the family, but since his illness, his wife has felt helpless. At 7 o'clock, the manager called and asked if Lin Yashan was my husband. I said yes, then he told me not to be nervous and take it easy, because he was in the hospital at that time. When Shu Shouyu talked about this past incident, she still had a bit of sorrow. Ten years ago, her husband had a stroke at work, so she had to shoulder the burden of the whole family. The TCM doctor came for acupuncture, and each time it cost about 25 US dollars. So my burden was quite heavy. Later, he called the Tsuji Johobaru chapter. Then some Tsuji volunteers came to visit us. After her husband fell sick, the only financial pillar of the family collapsed. Shi Xiaoyu was at a loss. Later, Tsuji provided monthly living allowances to relieve her plight. After knowing Tsuji, actually they have helped a lot in terms of living expenses. Sometimes when there were things that I couldn't figure out, I would talk to Tsuji volunteers and they would give me advice. No matter how difficult life was, she still had to live on. After her husband stabilized, she started to make vegetarian desserts to subsidize their living expenses, leading her family and neighbors to donate money to Bamboo Con Bank for charity. I thought that Tsuji had helped me and I could also pay them back. I don't want to keep asking them for assistance. They have helped us and we should help others in return. So I made a little donation every day so they can help more people. More than two years ago, her husband had a second stroke. Tsuji volunteers were still by their side. At the same time, they asked him a member to provide medical service at their home. Lin Yasan became the first patient who needs long-term medical care in the Zhuhou Buru chapter. Usually for a patient like him, who has a stroke for the second time, his recovery will be more difficult. Fortunately, this Tsuji's sister did not give up on him and still gave him a lot of encouragement. So in the rehabilitation process, he has seen very good improvement. Accompanied by the medical team and volunteers, Lin Yasan's rehabilitation is getting better and better. With the help of volunteers, her daughter applied to Chiji University in Taiwan, and the family's life is gradually getting back on track. Thank you, Tsuji brothers and sisters. They have helped us a lot. I don't know how to express my gratefulness.